So I'm getting ready to build a box and I'm using Win ISD. Um, I put all my parameters in for my driver. Uh, what I'm doing here is shooting for SQ sound quality rather than SPL. I got two drivers. I'm going to go with a vented box because if I had these drivers in a sealed box and I did not like them. If you're going for a band pass, not doing that either. See, it's, it's kind of flat. There's no, there's no, um, that's it. Minus three dB at around twenty two hertz. What I'm doing here is see I'm set at twenty four twenty four point nine six hertz. That's what the box is tuned to. Optimize the dimensions. 11.06 is where I want the I want the vent on the depth of the box. So I'm gonna put that in here. I'm still good at a other dimension at four inches, but the vent is too low. <coughs> Vent mark is all right, but the, the length is too long. So I'm going to shorten the length up by maybe you know, kind of three inches. I'm still good here. I know I got 35 inch length. Let me take it to one inch, make it shorter, but I'm no good here. I'll go with three inches. You see, all the base is going to be right around the same, and but but fall off around twenty-two hertz. It'll be the same same loudness all the way across most. Check out something else I did. Got one set at tuned to 29 hertz. <clears throat> Two of the same drivers. Tuned to 29 hertz. There's the optimized dimensions. You can change the bot to your board thickness. That's set to zero. There's my showing the depth of the box, the vent is. Then you see it climbs. Climbs right around 30, 32 hertz. You get more, more bass. But then it drops off sooner at 24, 24 and a half, 25 hertz. I mean, that's not bad. I, I wonder how much of an actual difference that is. 
try something different here. Same subs, Bennett. Let's tune it. Thirty seven hertz. Change the color of it. Wow, what a difference. Make the bench the same. Oh, wait a minute. Optimize. All right, 11.6, same thing. 0 0.06. Two inches and I'm still okay. That seems a lot easier to fill. You see, I get that's around 40 hertz. But it falls off way at way back at 29 hertz. Now, if I was going for SPL, I would tune that box to whatever the uh, what is it the frequency of the of my Trailblazer, um, which will hit even harder at that. At, at the, and you want to tune the tune the box to to that frequency, whatever your Car's frequency is. That's not what I want to do. I'm listening to it all day, or a big part of the day, every day. I want my music to sound good. I'll be listening to some Dropkick Murphys, some, some, uh, Way down to Primus, but you know, Les Claypool likes his bass high and tight. So we're going with this right here. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'll start right at around 95 hertz. You see the dB. It's pretty much going to stay the same all the way across. And it, it really isn't going to fall off until. around 22 hertz. I think that's what's what's going to happen here. <laughs> 